Hello, welcome to another edition of Silo Design Solutions Tips and Tricks. This is Rob Windsor. I actually just wanted to make an amendment to a previous video I did. A question was asked on how to turn on toolbars on a previous version of AutoCAD. Now, I don't actually have that version to play with, but pretty sure all this stuff exists in the older stuff. Once they put the ribbon in, they, they put in the different user interfaces. So I want to modify the user interface. This is something that can be done on the newer versions as well. A question was asked, so I want to try to portray this as easily as possible. Adding toolbars to your user interface. I'm going to customize my user interface. On the ribbon, you can go to the Manage tab. There is a CUI, or User Interface, button. You click this, it will bring up your Customize User Interface window. There's also an option of typing in CUI and hit enter. It'll bring up the same window. You can also, down on the bottom, on the little gear on this bar, if you click it, this is where you go to change your user interface. Or, I guess not change it, but to switch it to a different one. Here is a Customize option. If you click this, it will bring up your Customize User Interface window. This is where we can add toolbars to our user interface. Right now, I am currently using the Drafting and Annotations default. So, and it says Current to let you know that, that that's the one you're using. So I'm going to click on this. Over here on the right of the window, it changes, and you can see this is the stuff that's available on this user interface. These are the toolbars. If you click the little plus to bring this, to drop down the toolbars list, these are the ones that I have turned on, the ones that I can see in my user interface. Now, how do I add toolbars to this while I'm here? That's what I wanted to talk about. Over on the left again, there is a Toolbars drop-down as well. So, we can click that plus. This is a list of all the available toolbars in AutoCAD. These are a lot of the stuff that you've seen from the original AutoCAD plus all the added stuff throughout the years. Right now I have over on my right, you can see that I have the dimension, draw, modify, view, zoom. Now, I want to add a different one. And if you see you, right here, I click on it, it actually shows me information about it. Unfortunately, <laughs> my user interface info just disappeared. So, you click through here to find more information, maybe even change it. Now, I'm not the kind of person who goes in and changes default stuff, so tread lightly. Um, I'm going to go back to my current user interface with this toolbars open. Now, don't click over here, but click and hold and then drag. So click, hold it down, and drag it over. And I'm going to drop this. You can drop it onto the toolbars, or you can place it where you would like it. Now, just to show where it is, let's click OK. My user interface reloads. Now, 
it is over here on another screen, so I apologize, but this toolbar was turned on through that action. Now I can drag and drop it and place it around my window as needed. I'm actually going to close it because I don't want that. I just did it for illustration purposes. I really hope that that helps out. It's yet another way to turn on a toolbar in AutoCAD. Thank you and have a nice day.